She was kidnapped nearly 26 years ago, playing with friends just feet away from her mother during a Little League game in Alma. Tonight, new details in the case of Morgan Nick. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us for Fox 16 News at 9. I'm Donna Terrell. I'm Kevin Kelly. Police have a new central focus, a red truck with a white camper, and believe it could be the key to breaking the case. Information police are sharing in a new documentary. Our Jay Burr spent the day in Alma and has our story. I'm standing in a parking lot that used to be one of the ball fields from when Morgan Nick was abducted back in 1995. A new documentary recently released has reignited interest in a key piece of information. A recent documentary was partially released in Northwest Arkansas. It highlights the case of Morgan Nick, her mother Colleen Nick, still emotional over 25 years later. See, Morgan is not a story or an idea to us. She's my daughter. And um, she's not a documenter to entertain people. She's a little girl. I'm a police call it a roller coaster for them also, especially when leads don't pan out. So, you know, when that happens, the main thing is to not lose our focus and, uh, you know, regroup and, and keep moving forward. But that documentary has released an important detail that authorities want to bring back to the center of the investigation. We believe by witness statements that um, the abductor drove a, a red truck with a white camper. Uh, the one we have a picture of was from the ballpark. Uh, and and the, the owner of that one's never been identified. Colleen Nick said she wanted to throw up when she actually saw the truck that may have taken Morgan. Always known that there was a red truck with a white camper involved. Like everyone always knew that. But having an actual photograph of that truck, it really changes things because now it's not just a vague notion of a red truck with a white camper. We know what it looks like. Police say even if witnesses didn't see the truck at the ballpark, they're hoping it will jog memories of seeing it all over Alma. Uh, I believe there's seven locations altogether uh, from that day. Uh, so, you know, even though you may know something that someone wasn't at the ball game, but they were in the Alma area, then obviously we're, we're, those are the leads we're looking for. Colleen believes someone knows who owned that truck and pleads they let them know who. They hold the key to finding Morgan. And I cannot imagine the courage and the strength that it will take for them to make the call, but we need them to do it. Morgan was six years old when she was taken. She's waited 26 years to be found. And now the police tell me if you have any information regarding that red truck with the white camper, you can either call them or the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. In Alma, Jay Burr, Fox 16 News.